Hello, so I'm going to be doing a video explaining why you shouldn't always summon your heroes, even if you have the souls to do so, right? I get asked this question a lot is why haven't I summoned these heroes? And I'll explain, right? So if you don't summon these heroes, you, it doesn't count as actually having those heroes. So if you say you get, you actually acquire the hero, like say through like, like maybe like a daily bonus, right? Hero of the month right now is Morgan. I believe to summon her, you need 80 souls. So that would be, it makes her three star to summon. But right, so if you don't have Morgan when this event started and you get to day seven, you automatically summon Morgan with, you know, those 80 souls initially, right? Even if you don't have a single soul for her. But if you already summoned her, you would only get 30 souls. So you lose out on 50 souls, right? So that, that's, uh, that can be relevant. I mean, you know, part of this game is just getting incremental advantages and maximizing resources. You know, and getting an extra 50 souls can help you get a hero to absolute star quicker. Another reason not to do it is sometimes there will be events that reward skins, right, for heroes. But if you don't have the heroes you get a skin for, right, say like this Kark skin, right? I have not summoned Kark, right? So if I earn the skin rather than gain the skin because I don't have Kark, I'll actually just get 5,000 agility skin stones. So, right, which is going to be a lot better value for me because I don't need a random skin for a hero I'm not planning on using, but getting 5,000 agility skin stones, which I can invest in a hero that I will use, is much, much better, right? And that's and I can do that because I have decided not to summon Kark, even though I have the soul stones to do so, right? You know, this just kind of, you know, something to think, keep in mind. Um, the only downside to not summoning heroes, really, is that you can't use them in max testing, right? If I wanted to create a hero challenge, right, with, with Kark, I can't do so because I haven't summoned him, but I do have guildmates who can always put him in a battle challenge for me, like my friend, my guildmate here, he has a Kark line, right? So, you know, you can always just ask a guildmate to put him up for you if you don't have him yourself. Anyway, I hope you found this video informative. Thank you for watching.